a friend of black people, And the people are trying to get on Abby talking about you getting authorities involved. There's a difference between wanting to, threatening somebody to fight them and blackmailing them. That's a two different. That's two different. Well, personal. Video. Exactly. You're blackmailing. So of course I'm gonna bring the police involved. Are you dumb? That's my body. That's my. That's that's we my body. Kim Kardashian, Kardashian, right. baby. Are you dumb? Are you dumb? No shade to them, but bitch, stop playing with me. I ain't no Kim K. Yeah, like, so, mm. with that being said, okay, I call my, my, my brothers, my people that I fuck with. And I said, yo, this girl just threatened me. She called, okay, so, okay, let's get down to the, the way the video or her being pregnant got put out. Okay, mind you, this girl talks about me to everybody. Everybody. Paula has witnessed her call people I'm really cool with that I used to make videos with. Yep. And literally call him and like... Tell him so much shit to the point where even he probably started to be like, okay, I know he don't fuck with her. Calling everybody. And I haven't called a person once to tell him about our business because it's nobody's business but right. ours. It's nobody who doesn't live out the apartment. And it's not fair to put our friends in that position. Right. Okay? So. All okay. right. Now. There's a friend from, from, from Michigan back home that... No diamond, you, more than us. Mo, knows diamond more than us was her best friend as she said and um she came to visit and stayed with us for a week and we was cool at the time diamond was dogging her wasn't even paying to her friend attention to her friend because she was effing okay mm -hmm. so her friend was actually acting like okay cleaning yeah she gave she gave okay, she gave her friend a blanket to sleep on the beanbag with period blood stains on it and she just was just, whatever. So that friend, when she saw everything on the Shade Room Teens, she DM'd me like, yo, what's going on? Why, why are y'all beefing? Y'all live in the same house. Y'all can handle it. Y'all two grown women. I was expecting her to be like, fuck you. You a bitch. Because I know Diamond is telling her friend about right. me. As she does everybody else. So I was on go. Like, I was ready. So I thought she was going to come at me sideways. So I was ready to. But instead she was like, no, I actually really like you. And I know Diamond is my friend, but I really want to. I want y'all to fix this. So I'm sh I'm unsure because I'm like I don't know if she's trying to set me up, get information. So I was like mm -mm, I'm good. A week go by, she texts me, and she said she called me. I didn't have her number saved, and then I didn't answer. And she said it's so and so. Please call me. So I called her, and she was like on some real G shit. I don't. I'm not trying to make it look like she's like I'm not trying to make it look like I'm trying to be wishy-washy or switch sides but i'm calling you to find out something i said what she said when because her net or her dude that she fucks with or whatever comes out here she asked me if diamond um did anything with him and i was like not that i know of i just know they fell asleep in the same bed and they're really flirty flirty like a married yeah. couple i have to ask slash, that i was like wait isn't that what's her name nigga? So yeah. why are they in the same bed because i know i wouldn't do something and like she that. was around them as well yeah. and she said it was like married couple Kind of they're sibling. a weird like incest type shit. Yeah. yeah, and but the thing is, they're not even related, and they had something in the past before her friend was involved. But when her friend got involved, that shit was dead. But now that her and her friend aren't, her and, at the end of the day, her friend hit me up. Okay, she was like, my nigga told me that Diamond isn't my friend. If a nigga tell you that, listen, mm -hmm. cause he knows something you don't. Right. He knows something you don't. Period. So she was like, Abby, I just need you to, like, you know, like, I don't know how to go about this, and I know you're cool, and she used to talk about me. No, she used to talk about you to me, so why wouldn't she talk about me to you? Because mm -hmm. reality, she did talk about her friend from back home. She said that her friend was trying to cl cl clout chase. Mm -hmm. She said that her friend was lazy. When Kay had that talk on the edge of Diamond's bed with Diamond without me there, Kay said that Diamond tried to c say for Kay not to be like her friend from back home because her friend was here and asked for YouTube help. She didn't try to jock off nobody's wave, nothing. But you try to make it seem like your friend was doing that and try to tell Kay not to be like her. Mm -hmm. Okay. So her friend from back home decided I'm not going to be her friend. But she played it cool because she was supposed to come to L.A. Her friend wanted to come to L.A. and see her face to face. But because whatever happened, she couldn't come to L.A., she went accordingly. She found out that, well, Diamond told her she got pregnant. I'll show you the receipts for that. Because I have the pregnancy test. Which you guys saw in DDG's vlog. And to make it seem like she wasn't pregnant. She did a prank on her family. But in reality. That wasn't the case. Receipts. Receipts. How I love them. Hmm. Receipts. 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 How I love them. Oh. 
Ugh. Why can't I just go to the Mexican Carnival? Oh, duh. Are we still going to this party? I forgot all about it. We should go though. Yeah, I didn't want to. Yeah. And I'm just saying while I'm looking for this, I want to say to all the tea pages, the blogs, the viewers, I held my tongue for nine months and I can't do it no more. Especially when someone threatens me with um, one of them video. Oh, like, and also, we just want to address that once again, we did not link that phone oh, call. Oh yeah, it was not. And then also, okay, but wait. The second, no, the second thing I want to say real quick too is that me saying in Abby's live that, oh girl, you're pregnant by oh. she keeps baby. That news was already out six hours before no, yeah. that live. So the first happened. I Am New York's <laughs> video, I Am New York's video was posted already, okay? So when Paula said that, the video didn't blow up yet. It only had like 10K views. Not exactly. much people knew about it. Right. So when Paula said it in the live, it confirmed. And then they used my clip for all the new videos that exactly. came after. So we that didn't put it out information was already out. Like, that information was already on the blogs and everything. And that's why I felt comfortable saying it in a live. Yeah, because it was already why out. why did it take so long to say I would have done it the first day I found out if I really wanted to explain. So this it. is a screenshot to the friend of the two pregnancy tests of her sending it. Now, if she's not pregnant and she's lying about this, I wouldn't be surprised because she's a compulsive liar. But I don't think someone would lie. I hope someone wouldn't lie about this. Especially if it's being posted all over the blogs and they haven't said anything. But okay. Mm -hmm. Then, on Facebook, this was posted. She posted and deleted this. It says, I'm let this set here, dot, 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 <laughs> and say congrats. <laughs> let me show y'all the grammar. I'm let this say here. I'm let this sit, set here. Period. <laughs> Period, boo. Okay. Set that there then. Okay. So, so at this point, fess up to what you did. You told everybody in their mama in our circle group that I went and effed or messed with or talked to or associate with your nigga that you tried to put me on with in the beginning. But you did it to your friend to now where you're pregnant. And you can't fess up and say what the fuck you did. Because you, cause you know you was just being so shady and messy. You can't even fess up to what you did. So now you're trying to make us look crazy. We did not, not put crazy. out the... And let me tell you something. To her friend that, that leaked it, she'll come on this phone call right now and, and say, say she yes, did it and did what? Bad. She will say she did it and what? Well, she did say to Diamond. She said to Diamond, yeah, I did it. Now what's up? No, well, they fought once already. Yeah, they already fought once. So, the fuck? You knew? And then, okay, so the reason why she came out with the blackmailing and saying, oh, the videotape, because she thought that we leaked it. But instead of calling us, what she do to me? My videos are gone. She got, talk about that. We, bro, like, we knew about her being pregnant with Sosa's baby. We honestly, it was funny to us, but we're not the ones who leaked it. We didn't plan on leaking it. We didn't even like, no, it wasn't even like, plan. it just happened. It just seemed to just happen. It got leaked and we knew who leaked it, but we, Wait. me and Abby K didn't say anything. We didn't post about it. We didn't do nothing, not even tweet about we it. Nothing. We just, we just laughed at it because we were like, we don't care. We're not going to make this any deeper. So since Diamond was helping me with my YouTube videos when she was here and we were living together and we were cool. Um, I had stayed logged into my YouTube account. Her thinking that it was us who leaked that video, she went on there spitefully and deleted and all since my people videos. Leak my number, and since people want to leak my number, this is how we found out it was Diamond. Because she changed the number that you send the confirmation code to, to her number so she can change Paula's email. So the reason, the way we knew is because I looked at the number and looked at my phone and said, oh, this that's Diamond's, Diamond's number. number. And since people want to leave my number and be funny. And we had like a whole phone call after that, remember? Yeah. Did I text you that? Is your phone still dead? My phone. Uh, it's not dead, I don't think so. So I should And, oh, and back to the Bilu shoot. Me and Paula were there with Daryl. And what did Daryl try to do? Oh, Daryl tried to take me to this event with him so, so I can bring you connections because I know celebrities. His manager, Dimitri. No, no, we're not going too detailed. The point I'm trying to make is they didn't have an issue with us. She made it to where no, motherfuckers don't fuck with us. us. He wanted you to go to BET Weekend with you because he knows you have connections. And sis just kept going at her family's neck until they started to fucking hate us. They never had an issue with us. Yep. Remember when the shade came to vlog and he was in my room? Daryl was like, yo, your room is bomb. Like, remember? Mm -hmm. So all this, cool. Sis was just digging the issue to make sure that nobody fucks with us. And then try to make it seem like, oh, you mad because nobody fucks with you. No, baby. No. Care. I never. Okay. So this is how we found out. Bitch, Diamond is dead ass and
all the shit changing her stuff to her number. Change it back to mine. Yo, it's no, that's ridiculous. Amount of people in this line. Okay, hold on, let me know. Y'all don't know the fucking Here's the number. Screenshot it. Blow her up for lying on us. Well, you don't even need to do that, but here's the number since people leaked mine and I gotta change mine. I guess we both gotta change ours. Okay. So that's that was that, right? That was that. Okay, so after that, after she deleted Paula's YouTube videos, and I got on live because I was heated. That's the that's the little clip that all the blogs are posting. I got on live because she called my phone. And said, oh, I got so-and-so on you. I'm going to post it. I'm going to post it. Oh, so you blackmailing me now. All right. So I got on live and said, see, this is not what we're not about to fucking do. And I was about to do what I'm doing now on that live, but in a more angry way. So it would have probably came out more disrespectful. Okay. It would have been like, pussy. It would have been that. But I'm happy. I did not. I got off. I got off when it started to get heated. I called authorities. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Because you're not about to blackmail me over something that's mine, baby. No, we're not doing that. So I called authorities and I let them know her name, where she lives. And then I texted her. I said, blackmailing for a video of mine is below the belt, Diamond. I'll show you that. Right. See, I said, I said, I already got authorities involved. So, like, play with it. All right? So five minutes after that, she calls back. We have that conversation recorded. We don't even need to play it because yeah. it's two, it was an hour-long conversation. Mm -hmm. But she said, she said, when she called back, whole different demeanor. Matter of fact, I'm adding Breezy real quick. He should be on here because he's DMing me. Let me see. Let's see, let me see. Where are you, 600? Here you go. Because, nah, he going to fess up for shit that was done. Because bitch is not about to do that. <laughs> hey, Paul! <laughs> <laughs> hey. How you doing? Hey, look. <laughs> I just got to say, like, everything that Abby on here saying is facts. Like, nothing but facts. She's not lying about shit. Everything is facts. <laughs> Factual. Like, on my dead homie session, she's not lying. <laughs> okay, now let me, just say, let me just ask you something, Rizzo. Let me just ask you something. When me and my ex broke up, and we talked, right? Because sis trying to make it seem like you, like, oh, Bri you ugly. Breezy never did that. Please tell them that we was, we was vibing and we was cool. And it wasn't even on her accord. They ain't had nothing to do with her. She's in here tweeting about a nigga that I ain't even worried about her no more. Listen, you know that bitch half retarded, slow, stupid, dumb. No, 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 no. Illiterate. I'm beating that bitch stupid as hell on King Day. She's so stupid. That bitch tried, she gonna send me a pregnancy test of somebody else's shit. Oh, Biddy, like. Oh, oh wait, no, you know I didn't tell you? She went in my phone, and I don't know if you heard me say it, but she went in my phone and sent herself a video of me and my nigga to herself and blackmailed me with it when she know that you know you got some. <laughs> hey. She did what? <laughs> she went in my phone again when we wasn't even beefing. She sent a video of me and my ex, you know, doing our thing yeah. to herself. Yeah. To, and kept it in her archives to wait till the moment like this to blackmail me. Wait, what type of weird freaky porn hub shit she on? <laughs> oh, wow. oh, what is she on? What is but she then, on? but but then you mad at me because I'm talking to Breezy, but you fucking on this nigga, and then you homie hop, and then niggas got videos of you too. That's, so don't do that's that. Facts. That's facts. She sucked my homie dick first, and then fucked me, and I just got out of jail, so I was doing anything. I, I told y'all. Man. We didn't pay him. We didn't, Breezy, and on a side note, you getting jumped by us too because you should have been you should have been in this room with us. Uh, you still haven't been able to come to the crib since old girl left. So you need to get I don't know, I'm to hospital being cool anymore. I'll be, I'll be back, man. No, Kay, Kay, Kay not cool with you no more. <laughs> you breaking up. up. You breaking up, Pooh. Okay. But anyway. Up? I'm gonna call you, call you. Darby. Who? Darby, cool. I love oh. y'all. Yup. I love both of y'all. I love y'all. Hell yeah. But anyway, thank you for coming in and defending me because this bitch really tried to sell out on me all over the internet, trying to lie. And I just had to come with the, the receipt. So I'm gonna I'm hit you up after this. I need to finish the story so I can put this to rest and move on. <laughs> All right, I'm gone. <laughs> oh wait, did you did you did you see my little my little um my little music stuff I've been dropping? 
Yeah. You seen me comment on that. Huh? You seen me comment on that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You seen that. All right, period. Anyway, I'm going to hit you up, Pooh. All right, I love y'all. I love y'all, Pooh. All right. Love you. Love you. Zia's gone. Zia, shut up. Zia, he said you ain't going to tell him you love